welcome back everyone to another episode of Stellaris. I am playing with Jay and Rob, Zeo Fate and the Relentless Undead. And just like last episode, we're preparing to go to war. See if we can actually get me some more territory. So I won't be as screwed. Unfortunately, I'm just kind of locked into this one area. I couldn't expand far enough, fast enough. That in mind, let's get back to them, see what they're up to. I'm not going to, but I can make another fleet. Yeah, no, because your L gate's not online. I can't get. I can't transfer to it. Okay. Well, you need to ask to convince the people to please let you through their territory. Are they at war? Oh, it's pirates. Yeah. Okay. Two them, well, two of them went to war with each other. Research complete. I'm not dead last anymore. Hmm. That's interesting. Number three, right, it says you are. Uh, the, the, cause there's the Emperor of a 14th group spawn, Chris. Yeah, I know. Don't be happy. <laughs> I am happy. The funny part is that the uh, the the whatever uh, the Zana the the whatever pack number uh, four or number three, sorry, that's actually my uh, one of my friends. If I could do it that way. Um, let's see here. Um, our active comm links are firing soon. Might. Our trade deal expired. Yeah. It was just uh, for the uh, active sensors. Oh, okay. So. Don't worry, I'm still paying you. <laughs> Civilization's going on welfare. <laughs> yeah, that's what I gotta do. 
Entire civilization going on welfare. Yep. I swear what he needs to do is pimp out his people. Waiting for my second fleet to be finished building so I can do some upgrades. Oh, someone died. My economy can't make up its mind what it's doing. Sounds about right. Oh my god, I had more options than just... Research yep. complete. Like seriously, it goes from everything's tanking to... Oh, you're all good except for the little bit here, a little bit there. So I build some ministries for that. And then all of a sudden it's like, oh, your energy is now in the negatives by a stupid amount. Then again, that actually could be because of you. Uh, and he's just blaming Chris like that. Yep. No, uh, no, I'm not, <laughs> I'm not blaming Chris. I'm talking about one of my fleets that I moved. I'm just making a joke. That... Okay. I can get at, uh, I can get at the Satori Autocracy. It might just take me a little bit. We're not going anywhere. I, 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 can, I can use the experimental jumps to turn around and just fly over into his space. I didn't realize that I can actually just scroll down in research and to see much more research. Yep. Sometimes you can. I can't in most of mine. I didn't realize I could. Oh, yeah. So there's been a couple of texts that I've just, I've been sitting on and being, like, I only thought there was like the three, so I was like, okay, well, I guess I'll just pick these three.
Research complete. Research complete. Gotta be population as the population's bouncing around between the different jobs. That's what's causing the deficits and raises. <clears throat> it's the only thing that makes sense. You know what else makes sense? Pennies. Some people say that they're a dime a dozen. Yeah, they are, right? <laughs> Except it doesn't work. Hey, that, that was really It can't be a dime a dozen. So, no, you're right. that, 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 you it can't, can't be a dime a dozen. Yeah, it can. That's why we don't make pennies anymore. Then no, I, the reverse. At, at, at that at that point in time, it would be twenty cents for a dozen. If it was the reverse, but still, the point still being, but yeah. I want to go to plants. Oh, it's going to fix itself. My fleet can't make up its mind. Yeah. 27k, 27.3k, 28k, down to 27k. It, it's because different research is adding up. No. <sighs> oh, it could be as if they're it's not on I the. Uh, it could be if they're not on the station, they're not getting bonuses or something. They're on the station, waiting yeah. to be upgraded. Can't be they, can uh, they can't be upgraded right now because I'm building a fleet. Yeah, they're 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 waiting for upgrade. Yes. Oh nice. More people closing the borders to me. Not that that surprises me too much. I'm working on it. Yeah, Shatori Autocrats and closed their borders against me. It's not going to help when I go to war.
Okay. I just want three more battleships. You bastard! You uh, saw my battleship! Research complete. I can create another fleet. Ooh. I'm gonna have two new worlds in 2,000 days. So how do I do that? Research complete. Oh, hello. Oh. Ooh. One of my scientists died. I think to be about that time, I mean, the guy was freaking old. <laughs> well, he died at 100 and. I had one die at 111. 180, 181. Nice. That guy died at 62. <laughs> <laughs> My guy died at the age of six. Mm. Research complete. What? I have a trait point. How the fuck do I spend that? Uh, by reforming your government. No, that's civic points. Trait points are... I think that's under people species. 
Okay. That doesn't help. I have one trait point remaining. Cool. How do I use it? Okay. Go into people. Yes, I'm under species. Okay. Create template. We can genetically okay. engineer this species, modifying their trait. Or modify template. Meh, don't really like any of them. Keep in mind, you can turn around and use it just to get rid of one of your negatives. Wait, what you negative? You know, that's what I was thinking. <laughs> Might get, like, venerable. You, your species will live fuck longer. Not an option. I need four it cost you? points for that. Save your point, then. Yeah, just because you got them doesn't mean you gotta use them. Fuck, I should use that. Ingenious. Increases my credits, energy credits by 15%. Go, do it. Need another point. Okay. How's your energy credits anyway? Uh, not great. I mean, I have a lot for now, but I'm losing. How much are you losing? 330. Holy fuck, dude! <laughs> I can't help you with that anymore. I imagine it's because of my ships. <clears throat> The only thing I'm negative on right now is minerals. The only thing I'm negative on is energy. I have 7k right now, but I'm losing 330 a month. Oh. This. Hold on, what? Uh, who are you going up against? And why? Galactic- Oh my god, you want to go against them? Fuck. I'm trying to think it here. Um, one of my quote-unquote allies is actually wanting to go up against uh, somebody. You know what? Fuck it. I'll help you. Oh, wait. If I just did that, I think I just I think I just declared war on the other people. They have the defensive pack. Uh, which, if that's the case, then... Um, if I go to war with the other group, I'm we're one hundred percent stopping this episode right here. Okay. Let me see my wars. I think we're stopping this right here. <laughs> no, that's gonna be a half hour long episode. Damn, this thing's gonna be short when we do it. So they are actually uh, straight out right attacking you. Um, what it is? Yes, theoretically, yes. Theoretically, they are a defensive war. So I'm actually not with you guys. They are dumb. No, what it is is that the Zanian Zan Pact asked me to help them. Go to war with uh, against the. 
Bucky uh, Empire. I agree. Not right. Uh, with the back of my head thinking that they would be at uh, the autocracy is in defensive pack with them, and they still are. Which means that directly I'm at war with the autocracy. <clears throat> so, <clears throat> you guys' only option at this point in time is Jay declares war on the autocracy and invites Chris in. I will see about doing that. The only thing that is allowing is the, uh, yeah, Star Realm RX. Yeah, I, I should be able to do that once I'm fully fleet, complete with my fleets. I'm just getting to a point where I'm just getting a launch point set up. Because the method I have to do it in is kind of odd. Well, I'm just letting you know that if you don't do it soon... Actually, I don't have a control of this war anyway. Chris, are you good to go for uh, a war? Soon. I'm just waiting on some ships to be finished. I got three battleships in the queue, and then we got a bunch of upgrades in the queue. You, your upgrades aren't going to happen. And your ships can pull back, can uh, go to you. So can you at least get your fleets to a defensive position? I can get my one fleet up to uh, my 28k fleet up to Mirzam. Okay, I am moving all of my fleets. Once they are ready, I will launch this war. I do not know how long I can, can can maintain this war because my energy credits are just going to tank <laughs> as soon as my fleets start moving. So, yeah. Oops. Foreign Empire claims our system... Yeah, you can claim all you want. You're not getting shit, my guy. Or you're declaring more stuff? Oh yeah, you're just you're just spending all of your shit claiming my stuff. Go ahead, claim it all. They can claim it all they want. It doesn't mean they're gonna get it. Correct. Spend all of your influence, all your points. Do I send you down here to claim these two? Not until their fleets are destroyed. A little over three years, and uh, my terraforming will be done. So, are we ending here? Or are we here? Um, we can continue for a little bit longer. I'm not too worried. If you guys need a little bit more time. Yeah, I'm just getting my fleets moving at the moment. Um, I'm just going to attack these guys while you guys are doing that. Because I'm at war, so...
actually, you know what? I think. <clears throat> You're gonna stay there. And you're gonna stay there. No. Because those are literally the only two ways into my territory you guys have. So I'll leave you guys sitting there. You guys will need my defense fleets. Good luck trying to get through there. Uh, I probably want to make um uh, or comic too. Just under two years, and I'm gonna have two new planets in there ready to go. Cool. Which I suppose I means I should probably be building a fleet in here. If not going that will get that fleet fleet able to set up. There you go. Bye. Okay. So basically what I'm doing right now is I've just got to wait for my fleets to hit that one system. The reason is because I can't go through these guys' territory just at the moment. They really don't like me. Not that I can say I can blame them. But uh, once my fleets are here, my fleets, I'm going to declare war. My fleets are going to jump from the Hematera system right into Nimorish system. Screw the hyperlanes, we're going to our, we're making our own. I've still got two of my fleets acting as defensive, and I probably really should work on building up my defensive, uh, my defensive group. Or my uh, defense platforms, because I've been neglecting them.
Oh, someone declared peace. Did they? Yeah. Not my war. Yeah, it wasn't ours. Making them regret and messing with your friends? Uh, I don't know if I'm making them regret it yet, but they're definitely not really pushing back as far as at all, so I'm okay. Hey, we're, I, can't we're, I can't even see where your fleets are operating. No, because we don't have that uh, pack if you guys want to send yeah, it to me here. That's true. Let's wait until the war really kicks off. Uh, sure. As right. he says, I have them 12% uh, of the way to capitulating. Offer? Okay. Okay. Okay, I am going to let's see. All my ship fleets are now in position. I thought well, let's pick this 60 days for my last ship to be built and shouldn't take long for the research uh, for my upgrading to be done. Well, I should have to just declared war. You should be attacking them. Ooh, those look some big fleets. So, hey, Chris, you're um, you're trying to push through now. Working on it. Like I said, just trying to get my upgrades done, so I'm yep. the best I can be. Well, the best fleet I can see of theirs is 21k. Well, that's good. My best fleet so far is 28. <laughs> Somebody's swearing at me. Yeah, no, they're they're swearing at me and insulting me. Probably because they turned around and declared war and just decided to attack right from behind them. Probably. Oh, those look like big fleets. Hey, Chris, you want to move your fucking fleet up, please? Is 
to Im oh, and this may off. hurt. This may be actually, this may be where I die. Oh, no, I got away. Okay, hold on. Pause. How fucking big is their fleet? I know what my fleet is. What is their fleet? A 21 and a 16. So that relentless, relentless star hunters? Hey. Why did I turn around and lose you. 15 to 20k worth of fleet power? Just because I travel. Uh, um, um, did you, you hyperdrive? Did right. you do your special yeah, warp never, never mind. Never mind. Thank you. I forgot about that. I, I legitimately forgot forgot that that affected uh, weapon output and everything else, I guess, for a while. Hey, Chris. Oh. Uh, do you see my fleet? Uh, you don't see my fleet, do you? Uh, yeah, 21. Okay. Uh, I'm going to give you my sensors here a second, Chris, if I can remember how. Great. I need you to get, get your butt up here. I'm working on it. I'm just letting you know. With or without the upgrades or whatever the fuck I'm you have. I'm working on it. I'm letting you know. I know. I'm working on it. Like, as soon as you unpause it, my fleet will start traveling. Fun. I'm trying to get uh, us to share our... Um, what's it called here? Make trade deal. Active sensors. Active sensors. Incoming transmission. Okay, so this group here, I'm going to pull back to here. Uh, the largest fleet I'm seeing from the uh, Satori Alliance is a 21k. Yeah, it's a 21k with a 16 with it. That's where my problem is, is I can probably take on one or the other, but not both. So if Chris is with me, we'll be a 50. We're just trying to 50. Because he's 25, I'm pretty sure. 28. So we'll be able to handle them. 28? So, 25, 28. Yeah, I actually have to stay up there. Okay, thanks for that. Ships upgraded. Holy fuck, why did I just have three stations under attack? Why did it tell me three times? There's no st that many stations under attack. Uh, you pulled back a station, so that's being attacked. No, I see where it is. There's another one there, but I don't see where the third one is. Did your fleet be attacking another station? I don't know. Ships upgraded. Or it could also be reporting when my Research ships are attacking complete. stations. No, because it's saying like one of my stations is under attack. Ah. Like it's like those kind of like stations under attack. It's like, okay, I get it. They're not my stations. I get it. Okay, so they went up. Um, nope. Now I'm down to 26.7. The fuck? Yeah, it's because you left this spa your spaceport. So your spaceport's no longer giving you the benefits it was giving you. Yeah, like I'm, u I'm losing energy. And now I'm back now. to 28. Or it could yeah, be just driving. Traveling. Your population could also be turning around and switching up jobs. Just causing more screw-ups that, that route. Okay, so, I mean, Merzam, do you need me to move up more to, like, Lawam? Yeah, we need to go to, uh... 
You see the one that uh, they're in? Emden? No, the, the not Emden. The other one. Larstal? So, Lar... Yeah, let's go to Larstal. Tell your people to go to Larstal? Yep. Yeah. Because that's only one fleet. Yeah, it's 15k. So... Yep. All of us entering that should fuck it up pretty bad. They're sending more people? Oh, they're actually retreating. That's okay. I don't mind. Okay, you guys can wait there for a little Pause this for a second. How big is the fleet that's in there? That's the two fleets. It's a 21 and a 15. Twenty-two and a fifteen, almost twenty-three. Yeah, I, say. I don't. Remember. So it's like twenty-three and sixteen. Okay. Give me a second here. My uh, game. I told it to go one place, and it's like, yep. And then totally was trying to send me somewhere else. Okay, so they're attacking that. Okay. So we have to stay here for a little bit to attack this, and then we'll see if they're stupid enough to come to us. No, they're actually retreating. Uh, once we take this area, okay. Yep, pause. What's there? Can't see it. They're 22. Are you uh, going to Emden? Uh, I can, yep. Okay, go to Emden. How, me, do I, how do I claim this spot? Or can I yet? You, I have a claim Not on yet. it. We have to wait until uh, the end of the war. Yeah, okay. we have to wait until the end of the war. Okay. Yep. Ships upgraded. Ships One ship. Upgraded. Okay, I went first. Ships Get. upgraded. Where? Oh, okay, you took a while, but that's okay. Yeah, not sure why. Ah, uh, give me a second here. I'm trying to figure out. You want to take that? Okay. Ships upgraded. My fleet's down to a 16k now. Engaged. I've lost 11 ships so far. And we won. I lost 22 ships. You can actually for uh, go reinforce, and those set, uh, ships will come to you. Yeah, that's one option I don't have. Why is that? Because you're too far away. Because I have no, I have no clear path to my, to my fleet. Oh. So it's whatever ships I brought. That's all I've got. So you're too far away. That shouldn't be. Yeah, basically. But that shouldn't really be too big a problem. I only have about a hundred and ninety thousand worth of power. That's just kind of flooding through their space now. So I'll move up to the next place there, Chris. Yep. Um, trying to figure out if we actually if I could take this run. Where the fleet thinks it's good. So where are you going next? Uh, Pilgrim? Soyan. Soyan. Soyan? Okay. Yeah, I'm going to probably wait in Soyan. I don't know if I want to go too much further than Soyan. Without reinforcements, but... If you need me to continue going with you, I can slowly go behind you. Where you lead the pack night.
So whenever you guys want to end this episode, we can. I'm good to keep going. I know you're good to keep going. It's uh, an hour-long episode. Yeah, I think we should probably end it here. We we launched the war, which is what we wanted to do. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll think we'll end it here. I'll go do my outro. All right, so... Admiral Tolodrum. That doesn't tell me where he's... I don't know. Alright, so we've started the war. We'll see what happens. Yeah, I, I don't know what's going to happen. So hopefully you enjoyed this episode. Thank you for watching. If you want to check out more of my content, you can check me out on YouTube, Twitch, 19DeathTown69. And if you want to check out Rob or Jay, you can check them out on YouTube, Twitch, Zeo Fate and the Relentless Undead. Yeah. If you want to chat with us, you can join our community uh, Discord. The link will be below. That in mind, thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you next time.